My name is Faizo Kiwewa. I am the founder and the artistic director of Baimba. Welcome to this year's edition of Doa Doa 2021. As you're all aware, we skipped our eighth edition to the ninth. Don't blame us. The world did skip a year, and so did we. Since 2008, we have organized festivals, trained stakeholders, and championed a performing arts market that has helped local artists to level with the rest of the world and the region. That's how Baimba has contributed to the vibrant art sector in Uganda. This edition of the Adoa is thought to be a special one, quite different from the previous years. We are running it for three months, from May to July. Uh, once a week, we'll host a speaker and one artist for 30 minutes. We are going to learn everything we can about them. Curated to give a glimpse of the performing arts industry, starting from right here, the future space for the Baimba Center for Visual and Performing Arts on Lunkulu Island, to the Reykjavik Opera House in Iceland, India, Chile, USA, and South Africa. We are going to meet virtually with our friends, some of the most amazing game changers from around the world. They are going to tell us about their spaces, their initiatives, the opportunities, and the possibilities we thought this edition of Doa Doa would take us around the world and we think we owe our audience what others have got to offer and hopefully they could be inspired. And our second speaker is Mark Ball from Manchester, the United Kingdom. Hello everyone at the Bayamba Foundation and welcome from Manchester and Manchester International Festival. I'm Mark Ball, the Creative Director here at MIF, where I'm responsible for working on the festival, but also developing the artistic programme for the factory, which is something I'm going to talk to you about a little bit later. And it's really wonderful to be here today, albeit by video. The history of Manchester International Festival is really tied in to the history of Manchester. Manchester is known as a city of invention. It's where the Industrial Revolution started. And ever since then, the city has been making new things, from it being the birthplace of the trade union movement to the starting point of computing. Manchester is always about newness. It calls itself the original modern city. And so when the festival started in 2007, it really wanted to respond to that and to create a festival that uniquely would focus on new work. So everything that happens in Manchester International Festival, which happens every two years, has its world premiere in Manchester. We give an invitation for artists to be really adventurous, to come to the city, to, to try out new things, and to show things here first before taking it around the world. And we're particularly interested with that spirit of invention in really pushing the new. So much of the festival is about bringing artists together from different forms, different traditions, together into a collaborative space so that they can really test out new ideas and create new types of theatre, dance, opera and visual arts to really try and think about and imagine what the art of the future